Hey everyone, continue to pray for my health and pain, which is part of my health. Still deal with sinuses and stuff. Um, pray for my friend Joy, just stuff she is going through. Um, for peace for her. Um, let me think. I think that's it. If you have prayer, let me know so I can pray for you. Worry Less, Pray More, A Woman's Devotional Guide to Anxiety-Free Living by Donna K. Maltese. Wisdom Over Worry. Listen well to my words. Tune your ears to my voice. Keep my message in plain view at all times. Concentrate. Learn it by heart. Those who discover these words live, really live, body and soul. They're heard they're bursting with health. Proverbs 4, 20 through 22. David writes that worrying leads to evil and harm. See Psalm 37, 8. His son Solomon tells you God's wisdom leads to an awesome life. So if you want to have the best life, dig into God's wisdom. You'll find it throughout the Bible, but especially in Proverbs. There, King Solomon provides insight into how to deal with everyday issues including how to work, act, talk, think, curb your anger, and so much more. And the verses above, Solomon strongly suggests you learn some verses by heart. Perhaps you could start by reading Proverbs every day. When you come to a verse that really speaks to you, that gives you guidance or peace about a situation, memorize it. Before you know it, God's wisdom will stand in place of your worry. I want to live a good life, Lord. Help me replace my worry with your word. I hope you guys have a blessed rest of your Saturday. I hope you're having a great weekend and God bless.